Yo, what up? What's poppin'? Back at it again with another with another song review. And again, happy new music Friday. This artist, this is another white rapper. This is a white rapper that's from the dirty south. He comes from Houston, Texas. Like, this artist is a legend. And this artist, he still got it to this day. This artist does not need to retire at all. Like, his debut album that he released back in 2005, The People's Champ, that album is a classic. But yeah, this artist, he just dropped a new song with with another artist that's actually his favorite rapper, Little Kiki. I was wanting to do my review on Paul Wall's new song, Swingin' Glass, featuring a Little Kiki. My fellow Paul Wall fans, my fellow Little Kiki fans, my fellow rappers from the Dirty South, let's chat, let's have a discussion about this. How y'all feeling about Paul Wall's new song, Swingin' Grass, featuring Little Kiki? Here's my review. Paul Wall still got it. Like I, like I just said, Paul Wall still got it. Like, Paul Wall, his rapping, his flow, his lyricism in this song is amazing. Paul Wall still got it. Paul Wall does not need to retire from rap at all. And Little Kiki, his verse, his verse is on point. But yeah, Paul Wall, Paul Wall still need to... Paul, we, we we need OGs like Paul Wall and Hip Hop. Hopefully and eventually, it seems like Paul Wall got another new album coming out. Because Paul Wall, besides Millie's being consistent like Paul Walls ha yeah Paul Wall has been pretty consistent this year too it seems like with 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 some of these artists since 2023 is almost over they're starting to be pretty consistent they want to put it's like they want to put out as much music as they can before 2023 is over nothing wrong about that i got a i got a i got um some new music that's coming soon myself like i i'm i'm gonna do some recording tonight i got some new songs coming soon myself i got a new song coming called i apologize but yo i got some new music coming soon myself stay tuned but yo on a scale of 1 to 10, I give the song Swing in the Grass by Paul Wall and Little Kiki. I give it I give it like I give it like a 9 out of 10. But yeah, Paul Wall, he definitely killed it with his flow, with his lyricism. Like Paul Wall, Paul Wall is one of those artists. He's one of those rappers that has like a laid back flow. And and in personality wise, Paul Wall is laid back. He's laid back. Like, when it comes down to his personality, he has a laid-back personality, and just like with his rap flow, his rap flow is laid-back. But yeah, Paul Wall, his song Swing in the Grass, sounding dope. Again, my fellow Paul Wall fans, my fellow Little Kiki fans, my fellow rappers from the Dirty South, let's have a discussion about this. Chat with me, engage with me. Yeah, that's another thing that I that I wanted to mention too. I know a lot of y'all are familiar with the chopped and screwed. Yeah, that that that's the thing that I've noticed about the beginning of the song Swinging the Grass. It started off in the chopped and screwed style. When you see that that type of style of rap, it came like from from Texas. It seems like Texas. It seems like like hip hop in Texas. It seems like a lot of like rappers like they use the ch the chopped and screwed style. Paul Wall has used it before. Chameleonaire, Slim Thug. It, it it seems like that's a part of like the the culture when it comes down to hip hop in Texas. But that that's another thing that I've noticed. It, the song started off with the chopped and screwed style. But yeah, don't forget, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell on my channel, comment, share, like the video, love y'all.